So last of the Greyhounds being placed away. And clear. Green light goes on. Box five, Spring Tina, our favourite. Let's see how she jumps today. Set. Away. Only fair away third. Chance to accelerate, but goes down to the inside. Back to second last in trouble. Going to the front collateral. Got clear. Bottle Fury starting to chase out after. Two lengths away. Then in turn behind those, Spring Tina trying to stoke up. Rebellious Nick. Then in turn, well back behind those was Vibrant Lee and Blazing Strings. Oh, drifting up the track is collateral. They've got it. Bottled Fury, I think, got there in front of Rebellious Nick and Spring Tina and Collateral just lost concentration over the concluding stages. And I reckon it has run fourth, but it's a tight go. They're either side. Uh, we had Rebellious Nick and uh, Vibrant Lee pulling up quickly together at the tail end of the field. We'll stand by. It's a bog finish. Number one's got there, Rebellious Nick. One has beaten eight. Bottled Fury, take note. One beats eight and five. One eight five, take note. So, the favourite Spring Tina began only fair, went down to the inside, and uh, Collateral looked home and hosed, but over the concluding stage, just tired a little bit. And on the outside, the extreme outside, Rebellious Nick has grabbed Bottled Fury. Spring Tina third. And fourth goes to Collateral, who led by a length and a half coming into the straight. A half head by a half head. Half head by a half head, the margins here. And in a race where you didn't know where to look, the run home was 9.14. 9.14, the run home. So that tells the story in itself. 22.65 was the time. A half head by a half head. 1.85 and 7. 1.857. 1.857. 5.13 and 13.58. All clear. 1.857. All clear.